The skull is made up of several pieces of bone. Where the bones meet is called a suture. As the brain grows, it pushes out the bones, and new bone is laid down perpendicular to the suture lines. If a suture line is missing somewhere, then the skull will not be able to grow in that area, resulting in a deformity called craniosynostosis. If this suture line down the middle of the skull, called the sagittal suture, is missing, the skull will not be able to grow sideways and will become elongated. In this case, surgery is recommended because there may not be enough room for the brain, and in order to make a more normal head shape, which is important for social interaction in kids and adults. If we have a skull in this shape in the first few months of life, there are several good options for the type of surgery. One option is to do a minimally invasive operation where we just remove the fused sutures. Then, use a custom helmet to help round out the head. As the brain grows, it will push out the skull guided by the helmet, creating a round head shape. For some babies, a different operation is preferred that reconstructs the skull during the operation to make the correct size and shape. This operation makes a very normal head shape and size and does not require a helmet. The different operations each have their own pros and cons, and your surgeon will discuss these with you to make the best choice for your baby.